The mask mandates are over, folks. Ontario is now a uh, mask-free world. Some places we still need masks, public transportation. What else? Like hospitals, certain closed environments with high-risk people. You need masks. But apparently now we have to start living with COVID. Uh, for a lot of people, it's uh, way too early. For a lot of people, it's way too late. I don't give a shit. I'll do what doctors and experts ask me. I'm not so smart in this world. Uh, and no, it wasn't the truckers who did this. The Freedom Convoy. They're still assholes. Uh, what else is going on? Excitement. Excitement. Uh, last week, I think we played Six Nights of Bridge. Six Nights of Bridge right here at this table. I'll put a little clip. I should have a little clip of the bridge setup just to let you know what's happening. It's uh, pretty neat. It's all online. Everything's done online. People all around the world. Uh, everybody in this city must come together. Everybody in this town, everybody who lives within easy access must come here, sit at the table, because I'm not really an online gamer. Many years ago, I uh, realized that I much preferred... Actually, I never got into it. I, looking at a screen is very strange. I like YouTube. don't even like reading books. I don't really like doing one thing at a time. I think I realized a long time ago that rather than sit on my ass and look at a screen and play a video game, I can get on my bicycle or get on some skis, get the same rush that you get out of playing a game, plus I know I'm getting some exercise. Dude, I was multitasking before multitasking was a thing. All right, what else is going on? Anyways, lots of bridge. I am so good at bridge now that get this. I have to, I feel like I have to apologize to my opponents before every game for, for the hell that is about to be unleashed on them. And sometimes I'm right. Sometimes I'm right. Anyways, speaking of hell being unleashed, Ukraine is uh, slowly turning to dust before our eyes. Don't really know what Putin's uh, end game is here because uh, it's like walking into a... Uh, a jewelry store, seeing the most precious thing there, desiring that, and then smashing it on the floor before you bring it home with you. Oh well, possibly this wasn't his plan. Anyways, don't know what's going on. Ironically, ironically, coming out of coming out of COVID, where essentially everybody at this point is screaming and stabbing each other in the back. Everybody hates each other, and the rage and disgust for other people's perspectives on things is, is through the roof, uh, myself included. I'm no sweetheart here. Uh, ironically, we now have little talks and little whispers of, should we go to war? Should we militarize and go to war and fight in Ukraine? It's like, really? Have they not watched what happened the last two years? Anyways... We may, we may not. Everybody wants to spend like crazy on military. I don't know, man. I don't know. This is what humans do. We just break shit. We just break things, destroy things. I don't know. I'm not really into sending troops in there. Sorry, Ukraine. I don't know what we can do over here, but we just went through Iraq and Afghanistan. Ironically, ironically, American politicians being so indignant about what's going on in Iraq is a little rich for me. Uh, uh, sorry, a little rich, indignant about what's going on in Ukraine. It's a little rich for this, this hombre here to listen to when they did the exact same thing. Ex America was gonna invade Iraq. There was no negotiation. Russia was gonna invade Ukraine. They're gonna set both these countries back, although the European approach to things is much, much better than what it was for a lot of the Arab countries. Much, much more uh, positive potential in rebuilding and taking in refugees and helping than the Middle East gets. Ah, what else, what else, what else is going on? Games, speaking of games. Got a new board game. That's uh, not super exciting. This one's called Mesopotamia, Cradle of Civilization. A little like Catan, only you start in the middle, you got to go out, collect things, bring them back to the middle. It's all right. Uh, but it's like a $60 game. 
that I found at the local thrift shop for, uh, I don't know, five bucks, six bucks? Less than 10 anyways. I can't remember, I bought a bunch of things. And listen, for anyone out there who wants to get into board games, real games as I like to call them, not video games, real games. And tell you what, here's a good thing about a board game. You can put on a headset and talk in a mic with a board game too, if you need to do that. Anyways, get this game, Pent, classic Greek game. It's like 5,000 years old. Endless entertainment, kind of like tic-tac-toe, a little more complicated than tic-tac-toe. I played thousands of games of that. Pretty easy, simple rules. Uh, in other news, shot another video. Should I post it at the end? Yeah, I think I'll post it at the end of this video. This weekend shot a video. It's all right, nothing special. But can Drake be far away? Is that the next step on this uh, video ladder I'm uh, working? Anyway, it's pretty basic stuff. All this stuff's pretty basic. Go out there and enjoy. Springtime is here. Snow is melting. That's south facing. Everything's green that way. This is the north side of the house. Still a little bit white, but uh, dude, it is going to be a good summer. Everybody, go out there and enjoy it. New start, fresh start. It has been two years since COVID started, almost to the day. We're free. Go out there, enjoy it. Start new things you wanted to do. Start old, <clears throat> old things you wanted to do. It's a new season. Oof, go enjoy the day. Get a camera, film it, send it to me. I love that shit, man. Anyways, talk to you later. If you're lucky. As a kid, always did Think the stage would be where I may quit Some said go, some said no Let's skip ahead to about a year ago. Rolling with Gideon through Prince Edward County. 401 treasure chests collected my bounty. Empty song tanks gonna get their fill on the cute corner stage of the acoustic grill. Then I'm to Kingston we roll. Up the stairs of music here we go. New and old friends to the toucan we roll. Wanting to bottle it and take it off. in our sin but you know it's gotta go the other way eventually the river will flow back to Toronto with Lee and Stephen they're living room I'm never leaving then it's off to the cradle of the world hang with Andrew and Beth in the jewel of Mount Pearl get screeched in St. John's sit to Halifax and keep the party going Send on the Carlton with Marsh and Chuck. If Ed and Kate plan it right, I won't make a buck. What will this night hold? What new fun friends in this tiny town are gonna fill my soul with magic? Magic.
so much. Just have a couple, couple more. Couple more. Couple more.